This is how you fix what ails the Kentucky defense. Today's edition of X's and O's is presented by the Autograph Fandom App, where you get rewards for simply being a fan. In the last month, Kentucky's defense has gone from bad to abysmal to cataclysmic. They're outside the top 100 in defensive efficiency on Kempom. Over the last three weeks, they rank 195th in defensive efficiency, according to BartTorvik.com. On Saturday, they allowed 1.39 points per possession to Tennessee. If you factor out DePaul and Louisville, there have only been four worst defensive performances by a high major team this season. None of them have a shot to make the NCAA tournament. The problems run deep. Half the time, I don't even know what ball screen coverage they're trying to run. Here, Robert Dillingham is trying to ice the ball screen while Aaron Bradshaw is in position to hedge, giving Zakai Ziegler the easiest two points of his life. The same thing happens here. If Dillingham is icing this screen, Bradshaw has to play deeper. If Bradshaw is hedging, Dillingham has to force him over the screen. Bonus points for Trace Mitchell's help side defense. And this is just, I, I don't even know what to say. I found three instances in the first 25 minutes of this game where the slightest bit of awareness or effort to fight over a flare screen would have prevented a wide open three. Against Tennessee, Kentucky tried switching everything one through four, but the communication was disastrous. Here, Reeves and Dillingham blow the switch, and then Dillingham fouls Vescovy, who has a year to shoot an open three. On this example, Shepard is on James, Dillingham is on Ganey, and Thoreau is on Carr. After all that false motion, Shepard should be on Ganey, but he gets screened by his own man and is lucky a career 38% shooter missed an open three. The rotations are poor as well. Here, Dalton Connect has Dillingham on his back. Shepard's man is Jordan Ganey. Connect draws not one, not two, not three, but four Kentucky players and makes the kick out to Ganey. A dude Thoreau closes out, which he's supposed to do, which means Shepard has to get to Jemai Meshack in the corner. And he's lucky that a 38% shooter missed the shot. Here, Dillingham jumps at a pump fake, and then look at this effort to get back into the play. That's terrible. So how do you fix this Kentucky defense? You can't. Follow for more X's and O's breakdowns just like this.